What's going on guys? Big Blue Gaming back here with another NCAA 14 video. Uh, still doing this ODE rebuild. I'm actually recording this uh, right after episode one. Um, this is the third time I'm trying to do this intro. First time my game crashed. Second time I didn't realize that uh, when I was trying to record my shit was all fucking all fucked up. So just bear with me. I'm probably going to just speed through this but just a quick update on our scouting. Nate Jones, the only four-star on the list. We're, we're a little bit behind, but we're not too bad. Um, we're behind Pitt, Rutgers, and I'm not 100% sure what school that is right there. But we're not too far behind. We're throwing max points at him. Hopefully, we can get him, but if not, we'll find another one to replace him. Desmond Harrison is the, the jewel of our recruiting board. 90 speed, 91 acceleration, 90 agility, 76 carrying as a true freshman. 93 trucking, 92 stiff arm, and he can play corner if we need him to. 70 man, 76 zone, 82 press, and he can catch the ball with 74. So we'll we'll be good with him if we can if we can get him. We're in the lead, uh, a, a decent lead so far. Hopefully nobody even goes after him. We can get him really quickly. We're throwing 500 points as soon as we can, just because I really want this guy. I don't want to take the chance of somebody swooping in and stealing him. Um, Robert Fenner, 64 overall. He is a bust, but at the very least, he'll be a decent backup at right tackle, 75 run block. I can live with that. Or we can move him into guard. Um, 81 acceleration is okay, 76 strength, kind of low, but uh, 6'5", 327, so he can he can move inside if we need him to. Uh, Michael Walter, uh, we got to finish scouting him, but he's looking really good, and we're throwing more points at him just trying to stay in the running. If I have to, I will do the locksmith um, just to get back in the running for him because 73 overall safety. Um, again, he's not the best, but 76 zone, 87 speed. Just hopefully that acceleration will be at least like 85. Uh, John Thompson doesn't look terrible, but his coverage isn't as good. Um, but he's 82 speed, 91 acceleration. We are... Uh, right behind virginia right now um hopefully i did take points off of him hopefully we won't fall too far behind because i wouldn't mind having him um a lot of these guys really just weren't looking like much going on um like 61 63 and 57 overalls not really feeling any of those uh matt jameson looks really good uh 67 overall plus eight uh 78 man 78 zone 90 speed 84 acceleration we got to get him. Um, we're a little bit behind Virginia right now, but again, between him and the safety, I will use a locksmith. If I have to, I will upgrade that twice just to get them, just to get those two players. I don't care. Uh, Claude Barrett is our best outside linebacker prospect on the board. We'll probably add a few more. We're falling a little bit behind, but if I offer a scholarship, I'm hoping it'll get us back in the mix, but I'm not that worried um andrew trembley is another one just like the other corner looks amazing especially considering what we have already on the team 87 speed 90 acceleration 78 man 75 zone 72 press <clears throat> um yeah we're throwing max points at him um because we are falling behind on him but we're throwing max points at him next week and you know if it's down between him and matt jameson i'm gonna take matt jameson but I, i've got to get one of these guys um, Chris Henry, Jim, 76 overall, Juco transfer at center, 80 pass block, 79 run block, 81 impact, 89 accelerations, only 76 strength. I wish that was higher, but I can work with it. I can live with it. We're uh, leading right now, barely over UVA. Um, hopefully we can keep it, keep the lead. Scott Hunt, he's actually the one star, uh, kicking prospect, 75 kick power, is higher than the three star so we're going for scott hunt we're going for shane bowman too we'll see what happens um but yeah the the one star is actually looking like somebody i might actually want um these three offensive linemen i'm so disappointed but we're so far behind already navy is taking a lot of our guys but yeah like matt lacy's already getting close to having locking like having to lock out shit so like we're gonna be pretty fucking you know we're gonna be way behind on him anyway so we might as well just take him off the board and then the two running backs uh tavita huffman 
Um, there we go. 89 speed, 85 acceleration. Um, he'll be just a, a decent backup, honestly. Um, not not much else. 62 carrying. Like maybe he could develop into like a, a high 70s by his junior senior season, something like that. Um, and at least be a good backup. Like I'm I'm good with that. We need we need bodies. I'm I'm alright with taking him. Andy Haley is going to be our kick returner if we can get him. Um, we are in third place behind South Carolina and Missouri, um, but I think we're actually gaining. Yeah, we're actually gaining a little bit. So I think next week I'm gonna offer him a scholarship and boost his points up a little bit. Just I need that 94 speed on kick return. Like I know his acceleration is not great at 82, but it's good enough. But so yeah, that's the uh, update on scouting. I'm sorry that it took so long for me to do it, um, but. I'm really excited over a couple of these players, but um, yeah, we're playing Virginia Tech. I really hope my game doesn't crash because I really want to wear the uniforms that I was gonna wear. But if my game crashes again, I'm just I guess I'm just not gonna be able to do it. But um, yeah, so we're gonna we're playing Virginia Tech, and we are hopefully gonna have another strong game. We not gonna not gonna uh, spoil what happened, but um. It says it right there on the screen, but we're not going to pay attention to it. Um, if you missed the first uh, episode, go back and check that out. Um, we played ECU, and some shit happened. But, um, yeah, we're playing Virginia Tech. Uh, hopefully, I'm, I'm picking our powder blue uniforms just because, to me, they look sick. So we're going with those. I really hope my game doesn't crash again because I really want to wear them. But... All right, we didn't get this far last time, so I'm good with that. Um, <clears throat> so looking at our stats, uh, we uh, we're we're not too bad, honestly. We're our worst thing is our rush offense only had 110 yards rushing last week, 93rd in the country. But we're 30th in passing, 58th in total yards, 67th in points. Um, that well, that is kind of because we just kind of just started eating the clock there with like four minutes to go last game um defense is looking pretty damn good we gave up 115 yards rushing but honestly that was off of like two carries um our right outside linebacker had two uh, four tackles and a tackle for loss last game so we looked pretty good there um god i'm i'm not looking forward to going against amari barno <clears throat> waller i feel like is going to pick me off at least once but there we go. Those are the powder blues. I love them. Those are some nice uniforms. But I'm confident, but I also know that this is a better team than what we played last week. So we got to – our defense has to play as, at least as well as they did last week for us to have a chance here. We got four sacks, forced two fumbles, which was fucking huge. That does it for us um, on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Enjoy the game. Now, like, I'm, I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward to it. Like, this is a rivalry game for us. ODU and UVA are our rivals. Zero calories. Enjoy. So hopefully, we can win this game. And yeah, we lost a coin toss again. That's all right. We lost a coin toss last week, and we uh we won the game. So. Big game skill activated. That's scary. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take Davis off because he just doesn't block. Oh, Coons, you got to block that dude. I had that outside. Damn. Uh, DJ Mack played really well last week. <clears throat> um, I mean, he missed a couple of throws. I'm not going to say he was perfect, but he played really well, um, better than I thought he would. All right, hopefully this linebacker won't take off over there. Oh, smart, you've got to catch that ball, man. Wide open. You have to catch that ball. Man, I can't believe that's exactly how we started last week, man. All right, yeah, I'm not feeling that, actually. I'm just going to run a drag here. They're blitzing. Give me that. I was looking at the drag and I saw uh, Ali Jennings look like he was going to break away from his man. I love to see it. 
Oh, man. After having that drop on the first play to get a first down the next play, that's fucking huge. Ah, receiver's just not blocking. If we could have... If that corner wouldn't have come fucking hauling ass right there, I think we could have uh, at least picked up like six or seven yards. Maybe only like five yards, but I feel like we could have gotten more. Ah! Thread of the needle. Thread of the needle and dropped it. I mean, that's two drops, but that one's a tough catch. The other one should have been caught. That one, I'm okay. Like, I wish it was caught. It honestly should have been caught as well. But, man. There we go. Make that catch. I love curl routes in this game. Really. I'm so glad he caught that one. Like, that makes up for missing the other one. Um, I'm going to run Jennings on an out and Bly on a slant. There we go. I'll take it. Mari Barno running stride for stride with him. It's scary, considering that's our fastest player. Well, yeah, he actually is, because our other player that's the same speed is redshirted. So, uh, yeah, he is our fastest player. I'll take I'll take three yards. I'll take three yards. Uh, all right. I'm picking this play, but I'm audibling out of it, and I'm hoping it's gonna. Nope, it's not the right play. That's okay. We can flip it. There we go. Give me that 18 yards. I love that. I love the formation with nobody on that side because that's our strong side. Our left side is our strongest offensive side. Um, our left tackle is our best player. Look at that. And first down. <clears throat> Just keep marching down the field. Uh, let's go with a stretch play on the right. I don't love it. I don't like 34 being out there, but we'll, we'll try it. Yep. Elijah Davis lost some yards. I guess his first carry of the game. I can't remember if, he, if he's there. Yeah, that was his first carry. That's what I thought. All right. I'm probably going to chunk it down to the running back. Yep, that's what I'm doing. Throws it in a hurry. He's taken down. I'll take the seven yards, set up a easier third down after the loss. I'm not running a fucking... Uh, I don't really love a lot of these play calls. I'll go with Stick, and I don't have Coots on the field. That's, that's disappointing. Walk-in touchdown. Love to see it. Javon Harvey, I believe that's his first touchdown. DJ Mack had two drops that drive, like uh, Smart dropped one, and um, who was it? Was it Bly? Somebody else dropped one that drive, too. But that's a great, great start to the game. We moved the ball down the field. Running wasn't easy. We did have that one nice carry. Um, so we're going to probably take advantage of that formation, especially if they're going to line up with nobody out wide. I feel like we have enough speed with our running back to uh, to get out there. Um, but yeah, I'm 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 really happy with that first offensive drive. A lot better than last week. You've got to go up for the ball, man. I mean, I know you're only five foot nine, but you've got to go up for the ball. You can't just let him get that catch. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. Let's see. Get over there, man! Damn it! I really wish my guys had just a little bit better play right. If they had just a little bit better play wreck, that play wouldn't have happened. That would have been at least knocked down. Alright, 
My middle linebacker just doesn't have the speed. Burmeister's actually pretty quick. Um, man, that's that's tough. That's gonna be a tough, uh, tough ass for a middle linebacker. Um, we just don't have the speed. There we go. Nice hit. I'll take that. I'll take that hit. I'll, I'm good with that. All right. Henry had a big game for us last game. I think he's going to have a little bit tougher time with a quicker quarterback this time. Get off the block. Hey, nice stop. I'll take it. I'll take it. It's only it's only first down. It's not a touchdown. And that's no exception today. We're really looking forward to watching this kid play. Here they go. First and goal. Down by a touchdown. And the goal line defense digging in here. I didn't, I didn't think they were going with the quarterback sneak. I thought they were going to do a handoff. That's why I didn't push them up the middle. It's all right. Honestly, two plays is what cost us there. The uh, My corner not reacting and my safety not reacting. Is, uh, on the Basically, the first two plays, I think, first two or three plays, is what cost us that uh, on that drive. There we go. Just enough speed to get around the corner before that guy got to us. The quarterback did a really good job in the last drive of finding his receivers in space, and I bet he'll be looking to do the same thing again. Hey, way to fall forward for three yards. That could have been nothing. Four for 24 for Watson. That's that's pretty good. I'll take that every single time. Putting him on drag. <sighs> Sorry, that's the only thing that was semi-open. Maybe the running back, but I didn't want to check down right there. Actually, I'll put you on slant round. First down, Isaiah Page. Might have been him that had the drop. I can't remember who had the drop. Um, the other drop, that first drop. Another drop, man. That's his third drop. I mean, he played well besides those besides those drops. But man, you've got to catch that ball. Man, you've got to catch that ball. Actually, we're going. Uh, I picked the wrong play. No, that's the right play. We, the, for some reason, our fullback and halfback switched spots. That's what threw me off. I mean, I'll take I'll take nine yards from my fullback there. I'll take that every time. Um, let's go halfback blast. I, I feel like we should be able to run between our left tackle, left guard right here. There we go. Nice nine yards. Already four third down conversions on the game. <clears throat> I'm liking what I'm seeing from the offense so far. I'm hoping I'm not jinxing it. Smart with a nice catch. 16 yards. It's his second catch of the game. That was a little bit of an iffy throw for me because I did see the uh, safety coming, but I thought I had enough throw, uh, throw power to get it there. Luckily, I was right. <laughs> I thought he was going to drop it. I tried throwing it early. Maybe it's a good thing I couldn't because I didn't see the... Uh, when I first snapped it, it looked like he was open, and he wasn't. So I was, I'm actually kind of happy it didn't let me. Uh, it didn't let me throw it right off the jump. Ah, oh, so close! All right, we're running it. Quarterback sneak. Quarterback sneak. Ten for fourteen so far, though. That's a really good first quarter. There we go. First uh, touchdown for DJ Mack. Our offense has played really well. I'm, I'm really surprised. Um, we've actually been able to move the ball on Virginia Tech. 
Like it's been kind of slow and steady, but it's been working. Let's get an update now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese got a good one going in Greenville. The Owls find the end zone first with a rushing touchdown. ECU in danger going 0 2. Runner has carried him into the end zone for a touchdown. The Owls lead 7 0 late in the first quarter. All right, we, we're maintaining this lead. Um, this is going to be a high-scoring game because they usually don't play eight-minute quarters. They usually do like six. Thank you. Well, this is turning into a shootout here. Now, remember the last time we saw this offense out in the field, they answered the bell and scored a touchdown. All right, we've got to not allow big plays. We've got to not allow these big plays. And first play is 12 yards. We, we definitely can't run with these guys in man coverage, but cover three is not working, and I don't like cover two on this game. I'm actually going to pull him back a little bit. Here's a quick throw. Ah. Yeah, just they just out talented us on that one. <clears throat> Trey Turner is just too good, honestly. Like we're just we're we're in trouble with with their receivers. If Burmeister's on like he is right now, um, it's just gonna be tough for us. Offense is just we just got to keep plugging away. It's gonna be a really high scoring game though. Dude, block somebody. Holy fuck, you're terrible. I'm taking him out of the kick return. I'm doing that right now. You know, Brad, it's one thing to look at the court. All right. But for me, in these kind of situations, this is where you really test the, the, the backbone of the team. You find out where the leadership is. Let's we'll see if one of these linebackers, one of these defensive linemen can step up and kind of rattle the cages of the rest of the team. There we go. Nice run. A good job from the pulling guard to just go in and hit Barna. I was a little worried about that when I first snapped it. Let's see what kind of defense they're in. Okay. Ten first downs already in the first quarter. I think we're, we might slow it down a little bit. Just because um, we're, uh, we're kind of taking, like, no time at all to score. Neither us nor uh, Virginia Tech are taking any time to score right now. I'll take that. Um, oh, take the wrong play. All right. I'm actually just going to let the clock run out. I'm just going to let the clock run out. I accidentally picked the wrong play, and it was a goal, uh, goal line play. So. Uh. We played one quarter. 14 14 at the end of the first quarter. I, I'm, I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting a, a high scoring game like that. <clears throat> oh. All right. That's fine. Still third and inches. I thought I had enough room to make that throw. Um, Four for four on third downs. That's a lot better than I thought we were going to be. And that first down, eight yards for Watson. He's up almost 50 yards already in the first, right after the first play of the second quarter. Our offense is doing a lot better than I thought we would. Um, no, I'm actually not a big fan of that. It's uh, good play action. Oh didn't like it. I thought I had somebody for a second, but then I saw the pressure in the face and didn't trust that I could make the throw. Uh, looks like zone coverage here. Just give me the. Yep, I'll take five yards there. <clears throat> Got to take the check down when I when I need to. I don't need to push the ball downfield all the time. <clears throat> Third and five. Actually, original play. It's Coops. Uh, yeah, run that. Uh, 
I did not expect him to win right off the line of scrimmage like that. And I almost waited too long before I hit him. That's why I threw it behind him a little bit. First down, 10 yards to go. But that was a good catch. He's, he's dropped a couple of balls early in the season, but made a nice catch there. Nothing there. Amari Barna is just going to be tough for that right tackle. I think he's I think our right tackle is our worst offensive lineman. But, um... play the drive. I mean, he's, he's going to have to at least get in his way. But I'm not expecting great things every play. Um... I saw the safety blitz, and I just I, I had a feeling we could beat him up the middle. And he's okay, he's not hurt. But, uh, I mean, if it's not broke, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And we're actually running the ball up the middle fairly well so far. I'll take that two yards more than we needed. 60 yards rushing for Watson already. Not actually the play I meant to pick, but uh, it doesn't look like a bad play. We'll see. I, I like this corner out. Nope. No, I don't. Stone smart wide open in the middle of the end zone. Love to see it. I'm glad Stone smart's having a better game this game than he did last game. From the studio and Reese Davis. Let's get you up to date on what's going on in Columbus. <clears throat> San Diego State beating Ohio State. That's uh, interesting. Hey, our offense has come to play. Our defense, we just need a stop at, at some point. If our offense can keep doing this, we just need a stop. Um... There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Hey, first thing to play pass, I'll take it. Um. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Tackle him, tackle him, tackle him. He's short. I was trying to get back to the middle of the field there, but I just I didn't have time. I'm just trying to keep them from having a wide open throw as soon as the ball is snapped. There we go. Incomplete. They should punt. They're too far back. Was a very good stand by this defense. I'll take the drop. I mean, we've had some drops last game and this game. I'll take I'll take them dropping the ball every now and then. <clears throat> nice, pretty nice return there. 15 yards. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Ah, that was just good defense. Yeah, that was just good defense. Nothing I could do there. I think that running back has the confidence in his own athletic ability to be able to make that safety miss and get upfield for some yards. That time, the safety just dominated him. I need the tight end to double bar note and then get to the to the DB. Nope, he didn't. He's taken down. Ah, all right. Our defense just got us a stop. And now we're third and 13. Uh, looks like cover two to me. And here's a quick throw. It falls incomplete. Accuracy is such a vital part of being a That was just a bad throw. Bad, it wasn't a good decision, but it was just a terrible throw. But I don't think it would have worked the way I wanted it to anyway. Didn't get all of that one. I'll take that. Got it to about like 13, 14, something like that. Uh, all right, we should be able to run with these guys. Uh, yeah, 14 yard line. I'll take that. We should be able to run. They don't have any receivers out on the field, and we still got beat. First 
Man, I, I just my defense actually got a stop, and then the offense just couldn't do anything. Cray, what the fuck are you coming off of your fucking shit for, man? Stay near the sideline. You're that's your third of the field. That's twice that he's just fucking being stupid. Honestly, like why the fuck? Like you're playing. You're supposed to be playing, like. That should be a block in the back, but it's not. Because I was past that O-lineman, and he just pushed me. I wasn't expecting a triple option there. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 14-yard line. Cray is our best corner, and he is just getting decimated. Put your fucking hands up! That should have been a pick. And it said it's a touchdown because my DB just didn't put his hands up. But he was right there. I cannot believe we just gave up a touchdown that quickly. Alright. Um, we've almost just got a... Which is no blocking. We need to score a touchdown and have no time or very little time left. Just because we, uh... More attempts to create big play. Oh, shit. I didn't even see that dude. Alright. I did not even see that dude get in the backfield that quickly. I looked down and he's just right there. Oh my god, man. No, I saw him. I just thought I could get the ball past him. Just, these dudes are making crazy fucking plays. Oh yeah, I don't like that. There we go. Eight yards, I'll take that. <clears throat> 65 yards first half, I'll take that every time. Um, I'm not I'm not trusting the speed option. I like run, I'll, I'll run it up the middle. We're, we're having success running up the middle. And we're still having success. First down. Two and a half minutes. I'm just I keep pressing A too many times. Dude, how can how are your worst throws the short throws? No, nah, that was just a bad throw, man. Like he threw it way behind him. Alright. We need Oh shit. I'll take hundred yards rushing in the first half against Virginia Tech. Did not think that was even possible coming into this game. I got pushed back by my offensive lineman. I got pushed back by my offensive lineman. I didn't even mean to like call the play that I originally called. I, I gotta stop pressing A so quickly. Nice run. Nice run. Blake Watson is having a, a hell of a game right now. Um. If he can keep this up, we we really have a shot at winning this game. We got just under a minute left. We need this first down. Alright. I'm just going to put this uh, chew clock on. And... We're going quarterback sneak again. Touchdown. Second rushing touchdown for DJ Matt. <clears throat> 23 seconds. I mean, we're not out of the woods yet. They've scored quickly. Two out of three times. Um, I'm honestly considering just using 
my cornerback on the right side, my uh, supposedly my best corner, just because like the, he's gotten beat so many times. Got to make the tackle. There we go. Are coming like snow flurries in the winter. <laughs> and we still have time to go here in the first half. Who knows? Maybe we can get a couple more touchdowns out of it. The offense right. is hoping they can move the ball as well as they did on their last drive. I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync. Hey, I'll team. take that. Only two yards. I'll take that. It killed like five seconds, four right seconds, now, something like that. Really From their own, Just, I can't get beat deep. That's the main thing. Down. Just no, nothing past past me back here and I don't I hate user in corners I really do dude dude please lock on like it's so fucking stupid man like why the fuck do I just not lock on to the fucking ball carrier make the tackle there we go they're probably going to kick the field goal here. Um, they're going to make it, but I'm setting up for the return anyway. I'll take it. Three seconds left. Um, they want me to throw a Hail Mary. I'm actually tempted. Momentum swings have been fairly even. I, I don't want to turn the ball over because like we've had a very clean season so far. Twenty-two yards. I mean, I'll take it. We got the lead at halftime against Virginia Tech. Didn't think I'd say that. Defense has actually come to play. One stop, and then we got lucky on a missed field goal right there. There we go. <laughs> All right. Um. All right. <coughs> we need another stop. Defense has not been great this game. They're really good last week. The guys just are not getting off their blocks. I mean, we're going against a, a pretty good Virginia Tech team, so. Three yards to get the I'm, uh, here on I'm not expecting too much. How in the fuck do I keep on getting blocked when I'm past the dude? Because I felt like I had the angle to stop him from getting that first down, and then I end up just getting pushed. And I'm already past that offensive lineman. I don't know how that wasn't an ineligible receiver downfield. Their line was uh looked like they were a little further downfield than a yard. I think they're running to the left. Nope, running to the right. He just reverses. Alright, third and one. We can get this stop. We can stop this. I believe in us. We're just getting no push. Our D line is just not not getting the push they need. Uh, let's bring a little bit more pressure. Help out. Hopefully, help out a little bit on the uh, on the run defense. There we go. Only a two yard gain. Not too bad. <clears throat> Doing my favorite blitz. Dude, thank you. Give me that. Pick six. He's at the 30, to the 20, to the 10, and he scores. Touchdown. 
So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. That's what the fuck we needed. Two touchdown lead now. And that will certainly help build his team's momentum. Man, defense came to play that drive. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. That flag looked terrible right there. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh my god. He really got a hold of that kick. Are we actually going to have a successful first season, like make a bowl game our first year with ODU? Like, I'm probably going to have to make uh, make the changes to the sliders. Because uh, I didn't expect to be able to win two games against, you know, especially Virginia Tech being damn near 20 points higher than us. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on ah. off of mistakes. That's a great tackle. I got pushed off my spot. It's all good. I, did, I wanted to do the goal line, but I just didn't trust it. Um, let's just play man. It's our first time playing man in, you know, a game and a half. And I ran right past the hole. I need to stop sprinting from the jump. I need to actually get to the hole and then sprint to the running back. All right. I think it's going to be a read option. There we go. Only one yard go. I was ready to hit the running back. Well, at least I was ready to try to hit the running back, I guess. Um... Second down and nine to go. Bringing a blitz. Terrible, terrible play. Robinson or Turner is going to run a, a slant and destroy us, but it's okay. There we go. Only one, oh, two yards, but basically one yard. Let's get the stop. The one in the dime. And we're bringing a blitz from the from the uh, strong side. Ah, I didn't think he was going to go there. Good stop. You're going for it? Deeper next nope. time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. Mm. Yards wise, very close. And if you take away that uh, pick six, it's a very, it's a really close game. It honestly should probably be. Uh, 35, 28-24, uh, I mean. And we got to go like 97 yards. We got to go like 97 yards here. This is not good. 98 yards. Yeesh. Oh, I got to take the two clock off. I got to take two clock off. Because <laughs> I'm not trying to... to Kind of win cheap. Shit, wrong boy. Oh, wrong button. Excuse me. Balance. There we go. Second down. There, right, we got a couple yards there to, to give us a little bit of breathing room. Ooh, he got laid the fuck out. Ninety-one yards receiving. And this guy's gonna get his hands on it to make a catch. Hey, we're, we're only 25 yards away from getting the uh, second bonus, or uh, third bonus, really, because we just got the 350 offensive yards bonus. And he hits him mm. hard the 17 yard line. There's no hole opened up there. That makes it second and eight. Uh, we'll try this triple second option again. It did not work the, the last couple times line. he ran it. There we go. Three yards, I'll take that. <clears throat> Don't want there we go. I like that. I didn't want a uh, full-on complete spread. I'm, I, just stop. Ah! I thought he'd be able to squeeze one more yard out of it, but he couldn't. We got to punt it. We've got to punt it. We cannot cannot take the chance of uh. The punt upcoming, and they're gonna come after this one. Can't take the chance. Of, uh, ah, uh, keep it a little too close to him, dude. Make the fucking tackle, man. I thought I kicked it far enough away from him 
to get a good bounce and get away from him and it did not work that way it was a terrible punt you know, they'd like to that's on me a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to put the ball away. that's completely on me I... this offense has to step up to capitalize on this possession got the corner dude when you're running the ball for big chunks of yards like that you've got we're having trouble stopping black sheer um he's he's just shutting he's just running the ball down our throats Got yeah, lucky that we tripped him up right there, honestly. All right, watch the, uh... Oh, my God, dude. He just straight up missed him. Their offensive line is just mauling our defensive line. Like, there's just no question about it. Their offensive line is much, much superior to our uh, defensive line. That's all. That was all on me, though. That was a terrible punt. And honestly, I should have known that he was going to keep it. Excellent kick. Coons, man. You got to block that dude. Herbie, this just goes to show you those ebbs and flows in college football. You're never quite sure how things are going to go. It was going great earlier. Not so good right now. All right. We still got a touchdown lead. We only got, like, basically 10 minutes left in the game. Thank God he didn't uh, pick that. Because I had nothing else open. I had to do the check down. It was either check down or it was going to be a penalty or a sack. Because uh, it would have been intentional grounding or a sack. Didn't have anything. I was, I was hoping my... Uh, other tight end was going to break a little bit quicker. But, uh, yeah, that just didn't happen. Right. I don't really like the way this play is looking. Alright, um... I don't like this play. I don't think it's going to work, but we're going to try it. Oh! Almost caught it off of the tip. Oh, man. I thought I had that. I thought I had that. Man, that's so disappointing. Alright, hopefully this one will get away from him. I'll take that. This is that. why special teams is so important. The punter just gave his team great field position. I'll take that. That's what I was trying to do the last There's time, and I kicked it too to close to him. That's going to fuck up my, my uh, net for the season. It just... Dude, Hayden. You've got to fucking come down. 35 yards because our defense just cannot get off a block. Like, if, they're stupid if they pass the ball the rest of this game, honestly. It's looking like they're pretty stupid. Dude, get off the block. You can't even get off the fucking block down the field. Man, I'm playing like shit right now. How is that not offensive pass interference? How is that not pass interference? He was blocking before the ball was thrown. That's fucking bullshit. I mean, it doesn't matter. But yeah, that's... Man, I really want to win this game. I really want to win this game. Like, I really... I feel like we should win this game. take that only two yards we can hold him to a field goal if we can hold him to a field goal we have a chance I don't really like this play call I don't want to play man but we can't play zone either there we go got the sack man coverage worked just long enough 
All right, just cover three. Do not get beat. Got another, got another side. Fucking love it. <clears throat> if he'd have thrown that, it, it had to be ineligible downfield because their fucking offensive linemen were blocking at the five yard line. I'll take that. I will take giving up the field goal. We still have the lead. We still have the lead. That's all that matters. We, we need blocking, though. we got to have some blocking, actually. Actually, no, I'm not even returning that one. Just under seven minutes left. we got to run the ball. we got to run the ball. And keep their offense off the field. We need a couple first downs here. Big run. Big run there. Five yards. Take that every time. Like, I don't want to put on a chew clock just yet. Because if I put on chew clock and I don't get a couple first downs. Give me that first down. 25 yards. 138 yards from Watson this game. He's playing out of his fucking mind. Whew. If we could score a touchdown here, that'd be fucking huge. Yeah, I like that better than the triple option. I'll take it, because I, I I need to stop calling a triple option, because I don't trust myself with the pitch. Uh, let's go stick. I, I just I don't trust myself with the, uh, with the pitching. I'll take that though. Ten yards, third and two. They give us our 250 yards passing as well, so don't sleep on that. That might get us to another upgrade. We're not doing a draw. Um, I'm not a big fan of any of these plays. 22 to 31. Like he, Mac has played out of his mind so far this year. Got to block, man. Got to block. Are we in field goal range? No, apparently not. All right. I mean, this play is what got us 25 yards last time. There we go. First down, baby. Elijah Davis. I was thinking about trying to cut it more, but I just figured put your foot in the ground and fucking cut up field. Get that first down. Let's keep running this clock. Ah, didn't have anything there. Didn't trust any any of the holes, which wasn't very many. It's like, you know, zero. It's all right. Elijah Davis, you, you got the first down on the only play that matters. All right. Um, I'll take that. See the blitz coming, see a fucking linebacker lining up on him? Fuck yeah, I'll take that every time. It's the ninth play of the drive. <clears throat> take that, eight yards, every single time. Let's fucking go. If we can get this touchdown... Make it another two-score game. I like our chances. <sighs> that guard just got absolutely pushed straight back. Sorry, it's all right. I still like our chances. Just call a quick, easy pass, and know that I can run with the quarterback if I need to. Yep, that's what I'm doing. Slide down. First down. Let's fucking go. Going conservative now. 
We're going for this win. Like I'm not I'm not gonna be content just to run the clock out because we're not gonna be able to run the clock out. We're going for a touchdown. We will kick the field goal if we have to, just to make sure they know they have to score a touchdown. And that's just a tie. <clears throat> Five yards. If you haven't called a timeout yet, I have a feeling timeout's coming uh, at the two minute mark. I have a feeling the timeout's coming at the uh, the two minute mark. We're, we're running this ball. I don't really like this run. Yep, I didn't like it. I, I hate draw plays. I fucking hate draw plays. But I didn't like any of the run plays that were called. Um. I mean, we got to go for the touchdown. We got to go for the touchdown. I should have gone. I should have taken uh, conservative play clock. Uh, Turk should turn that off. I mean. We're at the one yard line. Can we do it? I believe in our offensive line. Actually, not so much anymore. They've got their goal line sets on the field. This might be a good time for play action. And they're in. Fuck yeah. Blake Watson, he deserves that touchdown for the game he's had. Just under two minutes left. Oh man. 11 point game. Let's get an update now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese. San Diego State beat Ohio State. That is now in the past tense. How far will they We have an 11 point lead, under 2 minutes to go. I believe in this team. From his own goal line. He's tackled. Oh, yeah. That's all right. There's more yards than I wanted to give up, but not a whole lot of time left in this game, Brad. They've got to score down two possessions, and they need to score as fast as they can and then recover an onside kick and hope to be able to have a shot to tie this game. I'm good with that. I'm good with that. <clears throat> I would have been fine giving up that completion. I would have been fine giving up that completion. I just didn't want to get beat deep. Second down. Just under two minutes in the game. Can we please not give up these bullshit ass fucking plays, man? I'm so fucking mad. Like, that's such a bullshit, fluke ass fucking play right there. I'm so tired of being past the offensive line and still getting blocked. It's alright. It's alright. Even if they score here, they still gotta get the onside kick. Incomplete. Minute 26. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Get loud. Oh, I pressed fucking Y and he just didn't go for the ball. Come on, man. That's... That's some fucking bullshit. First and goal from the one. I'm sorry, clock's the still running. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. And he came down with it. One <sighs> sorry, they gotta go for two. They gotta so go for two. Wide open. That's why I don't like fucking man coverage. Alright. If we can get this, we win the game. If we can get this, we win the game. Just go down. Just go down. Just go down. And they could not recover the onside kick. Well, that's a nice job there by their turn team to recover the football. Now they just want to run the clock out. Here we are late I cannot fucking believe that, man. Honestly, other than the bullshit ass fucking catch, that was a really good defensive drive, man. Like we didn't didn't give them anything. picks up about four yards on the play. The Hokies using their third and last timeout. Alright. 
offense, actually. I'm not really a big fan of this play call. Slide down. <laughs> there on the option keeper this junior corner has been progressively improving his run defense he's better at diagnosing see if we can get this first down i mean it doesn't matter because we can run the clock out but i want to get a couple extra xp points by kneeling no we didn't get it that's fine the defensive coordinator side of things and why not his defense just came up with one of the biggest stops of the game in a vital spot in this fourth quarter ball game 2-0 against two teams that are a fair amount better than us. Virginia Tech almost 20 points higher rated than us. Oh, man. Yeah. Pick six, definitely the play of the game. I cannot believe we won that game. Our defense did just enough. That pick six is the difference in the game. And a couple of other plays here and there. We got to stop, like, a couple of stops. That's all we needed. Our offense was amazing that game. I cannot believe we won that game. All right. Oh, we got another upgrade. Another ESPN Classic. It's very low bar because I don't, like, it's like a brand new profile, basically. Uh, DJ Mack, another very solid game. 24 for 33, 267 yards, two touchdowns. Um, Blake Watson was just amazing. 30 carries, 152 yards, a touchdown. DJ Mack, two touchdowns, seven carries, 15 yards. Uh, Elijah Davis had a big first down for us, and my, Matt Geiger actually had a couple of carries for us as well. Stone Smart, amazing game. Seven catches, 102 yards, and a touchdown. Zach Koontz, five catches, 47 yards. Uh, Javon Harvey, four catches, 26 yards, and a touchdown. We had a fair amount of drops. Blake Watson had one. Stone Smart had two. And Ali Jennings had one. Um, but Leroy Thomas gave up the only sack of the game. That's fine. I'm all right with that. JoJo Hayden was our leading tackler this game. Um, only turnover we got Trey Hawkins pick six is and that was the difference in the game uh, our kicker perfect six for six on extra points didn't have to kick a field goal um, our punter other than that one fucking terrible punt and that was completely on me um, he, he punted pretty well just take that one punt away and it would have had a good game um, Jordan Bly five Five returns for 111 yards, so that's pretty good. Um, and one punt return for 15 yards. Man, I cannot believe we won that game. Uh, let's check out our team stats. Um, they actually outgained us by 31 yards. We got uh, 10 more yards rushing than them. They had 41 yards, 41 more yards passing. Both of us were perfect in the red zone. We had five touchdowns. They had four touchdowns and a field goal. Um, no turnovers. That's been the key to us winning these games. No turnovers and forcing turnovers. But 2-0. Uh, and oh. Did not think it was possible, honestly. I didn't know if we were like – part of me was like, okay, we can probably beat ECU if we play a really good game, and we did. Did not even think – that we'd have a shot against Virginia Tech. Um, all right, so we can actually scout 100% just from the jump now. Um, I'm probably going to throw some points into Locksmith um, just because a couple of these players, I, I really want to get them. Um, we're skipping to next week. We're uh, at Penn State, so this is going to be a tough one. Like Their defense is no joke. Um so we'll see how that goes. Hopefully, hopefully we'll uh, we'll be solid defensively, and hopefully our offense can just keep it going. Like that's two games in a row, no turnovers. Uh, Chris Henry is our first recruit ready to visit. So uh, let's go on and schedule a visit for him, and uh, I'll go on and do my do my recruiting. Um, not expecting a lot of stuff going on. Um, not expecting a lot of stuff going on this this week. 
but yeah, we're actually pretty low. Like we're falling behind on some of these guys and I'm a little bit disappointed by that. All right. So we're going to schedule the visit for, uh, since we're in the lead, let's go on and just throw week seven, Louisiana tech. We'll, uh, we'll do that. Um, let's see. All right. Let's throw the 250 points at him. We're making up some ground with Shane Bowman, but we really don't need him, honestly. Um, I'll offer the scholarship. I mean, it'll it, it can't do anything but help us. The fact that he's a uh, a three star. So, all right. Um, and then these guys, like I said, we're we're a little bit behind. We actually took the lead on Andy Haley and took the lead on Tavita Huffman. So that's fucking huge. Um, Andy Haley, I'm throwing another. 100 points at him and let's throw let's throw a couple other guys on the board um let's throw another couple guys on the board uh low lock percentage um let's see there we go um let's just throw that on there let's see so I might go on and throw another four star on the board because it it's looking doubtful that we're gonna get that uh that wide receiver. Um, man, four six two. I wish he was faster. I would put him on the board. Four five. Right, I don't really need the halfback. We already got a good halfback coming in. The D end that could be helpful. Um. Four, five, eight. I could work with that. I could work with that. He's got really nothing going for him in terms of uh, interest. Uh, I'll keep looking around for a minute. Yeah, okay. I'll throw this guy on there. He's he's from Florida, so he is pipeline. Um All right. Now let's find a couple of three-star guys. Um Let's see. 438. Like I could really use that kind of speed. I could really use that kind of speed, but I, I'm a I'm gonna skip that for now. Um, I'm I'm okay. I'm okay with uh. Man, he's actually got a couple scholarships though. That's kind of disappointing. Middle linebacker though, four six speed. That's not too bad. He's got a couple scholarships too. Um. Four four two. I like that. I like the sound of that. <clears throat> four four four. All right. Um, I really want a couple of offensive linemen, honestly. Uh, not really feeling him. Pass block. He's pretty small. Yeah, I'm not really feeling that. Man, there's like no low lock percentage. Um, offensive linemen. Jesus Christ, man. There's like nothing. <laughs> Alright. I'll throw him on there. Hey, we got a jump. So outside linebacker Rod Hayes, he's from Oklahoma. Um, he's got really no interest in anybody. Like Texas showing him a little bit of interest. But um, yeah, I like the look of him. So we're going to go ahead and offer him a scholarship. That's very disappointing. Let's go on and just take him off the board. 
uh, Jamie Allen. 95 speed. Only 61 catching, but I'm good with that, honestly. Scholarship. Okay, 86 speed, but he's got better catching and really good route running, actually. I can work with that. He could actually be a... Uh, he could be an actual receiver for us. The other one, I don't know if he could be a receiver or a uh, just a kick returner. But he could be a receiver. Six foot three, two hundred fourteen pounds. Um, yeah, that'll work for that. So um, yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, keep an eye out. Next video we'll be going against Penn State and hopefully, hopefully, um, making some progress at getting one of these big recruits because that athlete. I really have a good feeling that we can go and block him up here in the next probably three weeks. So if you enjoyed this video, keep an eye out for the next one coming out. Um, we'll try to put them out like once a week, once like a couple times a week, something like that. Um, but if you enjoyed, please like and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time.